Matt, congratulations. You've signed a new deal until the summer of 2027. News that will delight the fans, but from your own perspective, what is it about playing here that, that you enjoy so much? Yeah, it's probably hard to put it into a short sentence, but I think um, everyone knows how much I enjoy playing here, you know, especially at Selwick Park, because I don't think you really get anything like that anywhere else. I've said that before. Um, yeah, and I'm, I've said it before. I'm just really grateful to be a part of a club like this. and. Um, Hopefully we can achieve more good things together. You only joined the club in January of 2022, so about 18 months ago, and yet here we are. You're a mainstay of the, the first team, a firm fan's favourite. You've now signed a new deal. Would it be fair to say things have worked out as well as you could have dreamed? Yeah, it's, I wouldn't say I came here with any specific expectations of, of things, you know. Um, but to be sat here right now in the position I am, you know, just crazy amounts of gratitude to be here right now. and I'm, yeah, really just looking forward to kind of pushing on and see, seeing if we can do well and first and foremost to the league, but especially Europe as well. The manager has spoken recently about your development as a player. He, he clearly thinks that you've got a huge future, but it was also clear that he feels that the best place for your immediate development as a player is here. Does, does this new deal signify that, that you agree with that? Yeah, I'd like to think so. I hope everyone else recognises that as well. Um, yeah, and I can't express how much I'm... I enjoy playing my football here, genuinely. Um, it's really nice to feel part of, like, um, of a family in football. I think that's quite rare, um, just in terms of everything we do, both on and off the pitch, in terms of community work with charities, etc. I think it's, it's very unique, and to be a part of that is, is really special. I mentioned the fans and, and how much they rate you and, and like you, but am I right in saying that the club itself has really had an, had an effect on you from someone who came to Celtic without much of a real connection to the club? You, you seem to understand very quickly what it's all about and what it means. Yeah, I'd say so. I think, you know, from the first day I realised kind of the intensity of what comes, comes about in Glasgow. My first day of signing, I was looking at an apartment and six builders like sprinted towards me before I even like signed the contract, you know, which kind of just shows the magnitude of the club. Um, and yeah, like you said, in terms of like the community side of things and the real togetherness about the whole city, I think that's very, very unique. And to be a part of that, like I said before, is, is really cool. And let me ask you about your teammates then. The, the dressing room, it's a, a sanctuary away from, from everywhere, but the connections you form with your teammates come from, from a real strong bond. How much does that positive dressing room contribute to you being happy here? Massively, yeah. I think it's important going into training every day, really enjoying the company of your teammates, you know, being able to have a laugh and being able to push each other as well. If you've got a good relationship off the pitch, I think it naturally makes it easier to demand high standards from each other. And right now, I think we've got a real good balance of both youth experience. I'm, pr I'm pretty young, but I'm probably somewhere in the middle of that because we've got a young team. Um, but yeah, that dynamic and, and balance is, is really helpful. Well, congratulations, Matt. We certainly look forward to, to having you around here for a number of years to come. Thank you very much.